woodlands and wildlife of New South Wales are already under extreme threat. Our new report, Hot, Dry and Deadly, exposes the harm that climate change will do to our wildlife and amazing ecosystems across New South Wales if we don't slash climate pollution. More heat waves, intensive bushfires and rising sea levels will wreak havoc on the places and the wildlife we so love. In New South Wales, temperatures in some parts of the state could be four degrees hotter with more common and intensive heat waves. In some regions, rainfall could half, fueling extreme bushfires like those that have devastated the wildlife habitat and communities in parts of the Blue Mountains and the Central West and in other parts of the state. In present trends, sea levels could be up to a metre higher, flooding low-level towns and wildlife habitat, and inundating coastal lagoons and inland lakes for up to 2,000 kilometres along the coastline. And so sadly, in the Alps, snow season could be just a memory within a generation. But it doesn't have to be this way. Big polluters and the politicians who do their bidding want to keep us handcuffed to the dirty energy sources of the past. But if we act now to source our power from the sun and the wind, we can stop the worst of climate change before it is too late. Join us to repower New South Wales today.